people living near Green Mountain and Lakewood, they see the smoke and the flames and they say not again. And at this hour, that fire is out, but the frustration is ablaze. Denver 7's Jacqueline Allen confirmed this is the eighth suspicious fire in just five months. They say just like the seven other fires, this fire was likely caused by a person. They put it out quickly, but it burned 2.6 acres and forced the evacuation of that office building as the flames once again got too close for comfort. I heard sirens. Sirens and smoke draw this mother to yet another burn zone in her neighborhood. Well, it's, it's terrifying. You, you know, I have a family. I have, you know, it's just too close to home. It this is the eighth suspicious fire in five months, and everyone is wondering if it was an arsonist waiting for a windy day. Do you think there's a fire bug setting fires? We have no evidence right now that points us to any particular person. We are still investigating the fires. West Metro Fire says it's not clear if this fire was set intentionally or accidentally, or if it's connected to what they've seen in the past. This all started last November with five suspicious fires in one month. November 28th, crews fought the largest fire seen all over the metro area, burning 96 acres. Then again, three months later, February 20th, crews fought two suspicious fires in one day. Now, two months after that, another blaze raises concerns. Fire in November was back to the west of us. Joe Margotti is on the Civic Association board. Evacuated from his home last fall, he realized how vulnerable this neighborhood is. We're encompassed by open space. I mean, we sit on the peninsula and there's open space all around us. With some of this area, you don't need much to start a fire. Several neighbors tell me they believe this fire was more likely started by some kids smoking in the field. Intentional or not, neighbors tell me they are planning to do some brush control next week. They also say they're looking at starting patrols and also looking at security cameras in the area. At Green Mountain, Jacqueline Allen, Denver 7.